Welcome to your reading and this is your May the 16th and May the 17th of 2020. This is for Scorpio Ascendant, Moon Rising and Venus Placement on their chart. Jupiter may also resonate with the reading. Cross Watchers are always welcome. So Cross Watchers, if I describe someone here and you know that it is not you, please, it's not you, okay? If I describe someone and you got offended because my description is a total opposite of you, then it is not you, okay? Don't fit yourself into someone else's shoe, especially it's not you. So, Scorpio, we welcome Cross Watchers. And for those new in this channel, if you hear some noises, disregard the noise. Um, my brother's wife is about to deliver a baby so there's a little renovation in the house they're doing a nursery room what's important here is the message right so disregard the noise I apologize for that um, for those new in this channel you might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online where I'm doing a live streaming and on the live stream you can ask me question and that will be free of charge so Scorpio, if you resonate with the reading, congratulations. If you do not resonate with the reading, they come back to the reading after a week or two. Time is fluid. So Scorpio, let's do your reading. Queen of Cups and Two of Pentacles. So someone is not sure. Someone is unsure if this connection is right for them. Someone is unsure if this connection is, you know, um, if this connection will come to flourishing, if this connection will, um, will give them, uh, the, say, will give them the abundance that they, um, that they want. Abundance may differ from different person right abundance may be literally money abundance may be a little abundance may be a, um, more attention abundance may be more love let me just put my MacBook here oopsie there you go abundance may be attention love care right time so what's abundance in you then that is your abundance. Knight of Pentacles. So this connection is not moving at all. But someone, even though that it's not moving, Nine of Cups is here. So this is your wish fulfillment, right? But the moon is here. Moon card. You might be connecting with a Pisces or has a Pisces placement on their chart, or you have a Pisces placement on your chart. But either way, there's really a misunderstanding. There's two dogs barking with each other. Um, there's some illusions. Your emotions are running high, and emotions are running high because someone's taming the beast in them. It's friend. Um, most people associate strength by being more aggressive right being you know someone here wanted to confront the person someone here wanted to talk to the person someone here wanted to call and ask the truth about in this connection but the most powerful or strong strongest here is taming the beast wherein this person wanted to do that but they're trying to be more of a bigger person so they're trying to keep their cool so the fight is not is also with themselves right so that's strength someone's strength is being tested you might be connecting with a Lyra or it has a Lyra placement or you have a Lyra placement in your chart the world card so there's a strong depiction here that um 
there is a long distance connection when i say long distance you could be far from each other literally and coast to coast you know bodies of water are divided uh, I mean dividing your land so different country or you might be living in the same city same neighborhood or probably even in the same roof but your connection is far from each other but something here needs to end so take your side if you feel like you are in a cross watcher side be it okay I'm not reading which side you at and I am also not I, I'm reading energies I'm also not um, into the genitalia okay if you are in a heterosexual relationship that's okay but for some of you Scorpio you might be in a same-sex connection and that's also okay genitals is not working here love is love and love is energy so that thing between your legs mm -mm, that don't work here okay if you are in a heterosexual or in a same-sex connection that's okay same scenario so for some you might be in a same same sex connection but either way heterosexual or same sex you want stability in this connection you want a happy life a marriage life um a family life with this connection and seven of swords so someone here is snooping on someone some there's a thief in the night um someone stole something from you um st stole could be literally someone stole money things that's valuable or probably someone stole your peace someone stole your um your love your heart someone stole your peace of mind someone stole your um focus could be okay you might be connecting this is a devil card you might be connecting with a capricorn or has a capricorn placement on their chart however there's a little extra here so i can also see manipulation for some i'm also seeing substance abuse for some i am seeing you know too much controlling jealousy so let's clarify the queen of cups because the queen of cups do not want to it's kind of snobbish you might be connecting with a Virgo or has a Virgo placement on their chart the hermit so someone here is enlightened um, someone here is almost not sleeping someone here is almost not um, eating okay but this person who is very affected they want a completion with you so family life is here so two of cups the hermit I mean the um, eight of eight of um, Pentacles so someone is working hard but again you are juggling two of Pentacles is clarified by another two of Pentacles so which means that someone is struggling this connection real bad and one is a 50 50 decision they want to go back and they would want to end the connection so let's see the moon here the illusion um let's see ace of swords and page of one so someone here do not want to commit a mistake someone here is walking in an eggshell because this is already a burdensome connection right if they're gonna make a, another move and that's a fear that they'll mess up so ace of swords they just wanted a you know a victory in this connection so let's see the world card someone here needs I mean something needs to end in this connection someone here needs to make a better judgment so that because this connection is not moving at all not really moving at all knight of pentacles it's an intentional not moving um, connection unlike the 
Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups, they want to move, but there's a barrier. Um, Knight of Wands moving in a normal phase. Knight of Swords, they're moving fast. But Knight of Pentacles, uh uh. They can move, but they don't want. So let's check the Devil card. So you know that you are the star. Um, you were put in a pedestal. You might have an Aquarius placement in your chart or you're connecting with an Aquarius or has an Aquarius placement on their chart. But you know what? If you'll just make a better judgment and you can make this connection move, you are the star here. You're gonna get your celebration. It's here. Um, I can see also third party because this is clarified under the devil card so for some I can see third party here that's why this connection is not moving at all okay um, here's your reading Scorpio if you resonate with the reading and if you want to go in-depth you can book a personal reading with me you can contact me at babailantv at gmail.com thank you so much for watching love and light to you namaste See you in the next reading. Goodbye.